We start with some adorable puppies, but they're more than just that. They help protect us from wildfires. They're Anatolian puppies, and a litter of them were stolen from a fenced-off area in El Dorado Hills. They were there training to herd sheep and goats. ABC 10's Vantu tells us how a change of heart brought the puppies home. It was an emotional homecoming. It was a real struggle not to cry. As herders reunited with Mallory the Anatolian and her six puppies. It's it just, it's such, a, it's such an emotional thing, that, you know. We get attached to these dogs, we get attached to the animals. We're so attached to what we do that when something happens to upset it, it's really, really hard. Lee Hazeltine, the owner of Intergrazers, had just started a new weed abatement program with the animals in the Blackstone community of El Dorado Hills last week. The pups in training to follow in their mother's guard dog paw prints. On Thursday, though, Mallory and the litter were taken, their collars left behind, the herders devastated. Whoever had taken Mallory and the puppies, we don't know all the circumstances, but whoever it was had a change of heart. The HOA and Integrazers took to social media pleading for the dog's return. The, the people who engaged in that, it wasn't, it wasn't get the bad guy, it was find the dogs. It, it, it was just fantastic. I, I don't know what else to say. By Friday morning, Mallory and the pups were dropped off with El Dorado Animal Services. Now that the puppies are back home, they're back in her training. And they're working really hard. Hazel Tyne says these sweet moments aren't possible if it weren't for second chances. A bad decision in and of itself, that's just life. We're defined by what we do next. And he says whoever took the dogs is courageous. That somewhere in there, someone made a good choice. And they, they, should, they should feel good about that. Our culture doesn't do enough in our communities and things, we're too, we're too quick to blame. We judge and we blame and we want to, you know, we want to find fault, we want to wear the victim hat. But that's not what, that's not what solutions are. What a great view on life. Halo Tyne says Mallory was orphaned by the fire in Greenville last year who overcame a lot of obstacles to become a herding dog. That was her second chance. The puppies will soon graduate to the next step, separate from their mother, and become herding dogs just like her.